he said. <laughs> which is a bit harsh. But uh, anyway, that's... Uh, luckily, luckily, we don't have a camera in here. Monica Doria Villarubla now. We are down to the final three. In a moment, we're going to know who's got a medal. And uh, Monica Doria Villarubla has had a pretty good season. She's had a ripper, hasn't she? A, yep. a, almost a breakout season, you could say. She's been on almost in every final. It's... She's been ultra consistent yeah. in the C1 and the K1 yep. this year. And what a great finish it would be for her if she can get up there on the podium at this World Cup final. Very tall paddler. And really has, as Brody said, this has been a great season for her. She's really put her name up in lights for Andorra. So she would have that ticket locked away, I'm sure, already for her, for Paris. Yeah, you'd think so. And she's had a pretty solid start, a little down on the first split. But as we've seen, it's all to play for from here. Here downwards, pretty much on the course, is yeah. where all the mistakes, mistakes are happening. So this is our third last paddler. The next paddler on the course will be Jessica Fox. And then the final paddler will be the New Zealander, Luca Jones, who had an unbelievable semi-final. Just picking up the touch there. I thought she'd nailed that move, but a little touch on 13. She's going to need to really find some time here now. Tell you what, the judges are on their A game, aren't they? I think they've all had an early night and they've had a couple of coffees this morning because they are picking up everything. Yeah, it's been good. It's been uh, very good. Oof, they see that one? They did. It's going to be tough from here now. Yeah, two touches for Doria Villarubla and the, the fastest time on the course is a 102.37. She's not going to go under that. Is she going to challenge, though, for a top three? No, I don't think so. Unfortunately for Monica Doria Villarubla, no podium today for the paddler from Andorra. But what it does mean that Corinna Kunle, mm. after quite an absence, and look at Claudia Zulinska there. She doesn't know where to laugh or cry.